on everybody, we're going to take a look at all the neat old bikes at Baby Motorcycles. As we take a look at some of this neat old stuff, we got the old vintage stuff, the old Honda, the old Triumph. This is a 67 Triumph hardtail. And it's just basically the way it was back in 1967. This was what it was. This is what the whole thing was about back in the 60s, late 60s, early 70s. And then the advent of the two-stroke motorcycles, when they started coming out, this is another thing that just hit the market that was unbelievable. This is a 74 250 Hustler, six-speed transmission, 250cc, two-cycle. Going over here, we got the R500. This is just something I picked up here. A guy traded it in on a Harley-Davidson trike. And I thought it'd just be a neat addition to some of the stuff that we're starting to collect. This is an R5 350. So this particular bike was a predecessor to the RD 350. This one here is a 73, I do believe. Down over here, we got a 1973 CB 754 with a big bore Yoshimura in it. So this is the cafe stuff that started years ago. And it's just something that I've been hanging on to for a number of years. So that's got a big bore Yoshimura, four into one Yoshimura exhaust, Coney suspension, 16 inch wheel, lace to the back. Then there's the old Yamaha dirt bike. This is something that's really cool. And these are all unrestored motorcycles. These are all the way they were. They haven't been taken and completely restored or anything. They're not 100% perfect, but nobody is, and nothing is 100% perfect. So this is the 175 TNT Can-Am. I got a 250 as well. That'll be coming out, and we're gonna be bringing that on display in the next few months. Here's something neat that just I found in a backyard. We got the parts to put it back together, but it's just neat to look at this old stuff and see exactly what it is and unrestored shape, right? Here's a Triumph. This is 74, Triumph 750 Bonneville. This one here has been somewhat restored and brought back. It's not 100%, but it's really nice, functional 750 Bonneville. Here, is an old 500 single Royal Enfield 350 bullet. It's just funky, man. It's just neat stuff. Everything two wheels. As we go downstairs, and as we're following downstairs, Here's a new Himalayan. This is a new 411 Himalayan. And it's decked up to get out, to do some fun out in the bush. And these are the bikes that are really taking the motorcycle world by storm, the 411 Royal Enfield. Not a powerhouse, but it's just like it looks right now. It's a pack mule. So if you want to get out, have some fun, load the stuff up, get in the back roads, Enjoy yourself. The Royal Enfield 411 is a great motorcycle to do that. And that's one of the motorcycles we've really been moving a lot of. We've probably sold over two dozen of these things. The new Meteor, full line of clothing, that's gonna be coming in. We got some neat stuff coming in the next two weeks that people are gonna really be excited about. It's gonna be a really exciting new line never seen before in Canada. That's coming out. It's going to be great to see that one. The Meteor, the 350 Meteor, that's a really good little motorcycle for the people to get out, have fun on, ride around. Again, the Himalayan. Over in here, the riding gear, the t-shirts, we even carry a selection of gas tanks. So this selection of gas tanks is another option for a person if they want to change up the color, 
They can just bring a gas tank in and they can do what they want to do if they want to trick a Royal Enfield up and make it their own. A lot of that accessories is coming in too. The dry bags, the pack sacks. This is a new 21, or 22 actually. This is a 22 Royal Enfield Himalayan. The new seat, a dark brown seat. The rear luggage rack, stronger, holds more weight. The new crash bars here give you the ability, if you've got long legs, this gives you the ability, it's got more knee room. It's got the tripper on here, so you can go on to your phone, download the app, now you've got the tripper. full line of Royal Enfield accessories for the cafes, for the in, inter, INTs, full, uh, full line of soft bags. So if you're not into having the hard bags, you want the soft bags, these go on with the bag rails and they fit nice on the side of the motorcycle here. So this is giving you a more nostalgic look than with the pannier bags. The pannier bags have got a certain amount of nostalgia with them as well. But these are more military, more rough, rucksack kind of look. Again, we've got the touring seats for the INTs and the cafes. Here's the one-up seat for the cafe. Stuff like belly bags for the Himalayan, magnetic. And then we carry a line of aftermarket stuff which we're getting large into too and it's called the SRC line of motorcycle products for the Royal Enfield. So you got the headlight covers, oil cooler covers, master cylinder covers, pipe guards, and if a person wants, they can put a larger rack on the back of their Himalayan with the lash down. Our BMC line of products with the hoodies, t-shirts, another Himalayan, the rock red. We're restoring, we're right in the middle of restoring a bunch of CT90s. So we're locating parts for those, rebuilding the motors, new rubber, new sprockets, new pistons, new rings. We're getting that stuff up and running. It's something that I've had laying around for years and years. We're bringing it up, we're getting it back on the road again. What's old is new again. And here's a 22 Royal Enfield INT 650. The new colors. B. This is the night. This is a 2013 535, which we brought in for my wife. It's never been run except around the parking lot. But it's just such a neat retro motorcycle. So, gives you a bit of an idea of what we're doing here at Bayview Motorcycles. As we go into the back, I'll show you some stuff that's going on in the back here. Out back, we got a road glide. We're putting uh, together a road glide. Just putting the new uh, fairing on it, putting a set of bars. And then back here we got Laurel and Hardy, and uh, that's Laurel and this is Hardy, and we're redoing CT90s right down to the frame.
And I think we got six or seven of them that we're going to redo. We've got four that we got torn apart right now, but we got about six. So we're going to see if we can make some chicken soup out of some chicken poop. At Baby Motorcycles, we've got the new 22 650 INT and the Cafe Racers. They're in stock now. Come down, take a look at these new bikes, some of the new options that they've got, some of the new colors. All the new street bikes have got three-year parts and labor, three-year roadside assistance, the Royal Enfield Himalayan, two-year parts and labor, and I think we have six or eight Royal Enfield Himalayans left, regular $6,700 for $6,200. Come on in. Take a couple of days off to go into Starbucks. Come in, spend that money on some freedom. Head for the hills on a Royal Enfield Himalayan. You won't regret it. Thanks, guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye.